Hey everyone, Sillycat2 here. Welcome back for more Nargad's Trail, Argon's Evil Lair. In the last episode, we discovered this new part of the wrecked UFO. And in this episode, we're gonna explore it a bit. See where it goes. Why do I get the feeling I lost an instrument or two? Whoa. Okay, it's a locked door. Well, it was locked. <laughs> Alright, I opened up that door then. Oh yeah, that's right, the level 7 sword is also supposed to be in this dungeon somewhere. So maybe we can look for that or something, you know, while we're looking around. Yeah. What's that supposed to be? And where does this go? Let's get it from here. We can't get over there. Can't unlock this door yet. I think we can unlock this though. Yeah. Kill that thing. Something tells me the sort this sword is gonna be very well hidden. So if I find it at all, it's gonna be by sheer luck and use of use of the lens of truth. Well, if we complete the level without finding it, that's fine with me. The level six sword is strong enough. And we got this, the Nova Hammer. You can pound and break things now. Let's try using it on something. As you can see, it's a pretty decent weapon. That just looks suspicious to me. You know those circles in Golden Sun where you can use Reveal and something shows up? That's what it looks like. Uh. Hmm. Doesn't look like I can get in there yet. Something tells me that's where the sword's gonna be, though. Alright, let's keep going. It's down here. Kill that ghost there. And here's a key. Okay. Also, I figured out what was slowing down my computer. Somehow, Firefox was running in the background. Can't let you do that, Firefox! So I just closed the process in the Windows Task Manager. Doesn't look like I can open those yet. I guess I gotta wait until I get the boss key. Since we have this hammer, let's see what else we can do with it. There's bound to be a couple of things, you know. How the sound those things make when I squish them. spots. Whoa, what the... Please. 
please don't bug on me. Okay. Hey, wait a sec. Can I bomb that? Doesn't look like it, but I might as well try. Nope. Alright, I'm gonna keep looking around for things I can do in this area. Although I don't think there is anything. Alright, let's go back to the main area. Just press Alt to activate that. Actually, no, you just step on the center tile. <laughs> yes, I definitely lost some instruments. Hmm. Well, I guess I'll just have to restart Zelda Classic after this episode, then. Oops. Didn't mean for that to happen. I can hookshot here. Here is the map! Finally. It's a good thing I tried that. <laughs> Eh, although I don't know how much good it will do. Well, I try things. Sometimes they even work. Alright, now we're back in this area. Let's take a look around. Pound stuff, you know. Whoa. Why do I get the feeling this is important? Hmm. Whatever. Right. There's a compass. Doesn't look like I can get there, but... Well, you never know what you can pound, you know? I don't think there's anything I can pound. Alright, so let's go this way. Ah, we got this again. Yeah, I remember this series of rooms. Well, I kind of sort of remember it, you know. Mm. Can we get over there again? Mm. Guess I have to do the ladder puzzle. <laughs> Whoa. Maybe not. Alright, continue trick. Let's keep looking around. Hey, stripes. The cat just jumped up on my bed. <laughs> and now she's meowing at me. You know, kitty. Um. So I have the hammer, but the usual Zelda question comes up. What do I do with this now that I have it? I don't really see anything I can do with this thing. And of course it would help if the ladder worked right. Hammer works pretty well on enemies. Yeah, you know what? Forget this. I can do it in the next episode anyway. Silicat 2. See you later.